Hello everyone, Professor Prophet with you. Craps University, episode four of Building a Bankroll today. We show you strategies on how to increase your bankroll when at the craps table. Uh, very uh, simple strategies that anyone can follow. We began this uh, experiment with $1,000 bankroll. In our last episode, episode three, we won $162. And that brings our current total to $1,411. Uh, we're going to play today from uh, 10 to 15 minutes, and that equals about one hour at a live table. And we're going to put $300 at risk. So uh, let's go ahead and get started with a $5 pass line bet. And first shooter's up, and let's roll those bones. Okay, we have a 9, so we're going to go with our 64 across strategy once again and put ten dollars on the outside numbers and put uh, ten behind the pass line to represent the nine and cap off that six and eight make that twelve dollars and first roll is out and we have a five there that's a fourteen dollar win and we're going to bring down the two sister numbers on the outside the four and the ten it's part of our strategy and we'll roll them again Okay, there's the hard six, another $14 winner. So we'll take down the five and the pass line odds a bit, representing the nine. And that leaves us just the six and the eight. And there's the easy eight. And that completes uh, all the numbers that we started out with. So we're going to repopulate the board, this time with just one unit. And that'll be 32 across. And number still nine. Easy 10. So that's a seven dollar, or excuse me, a nine dollar winner, and we'll take down the four and the ten again. And there's our seven out. So next shooter, pass line bet down, easy six, and we'll go back with the sixty-four across, and we'll put that uh, pass line bet behind the uh, pass line, and that'll uh, represent the six and cap that eight and we're ready to go okay there's the easy eight fourteen dollar winner take down the four and ten and roll them again there's the easy four we just took the four down so no payoff on that one it happens okay there's the nine so another winner we'll take down the five and the nine and we're down to just the six and the eight and we seven out there so that was approximately a break-even round for us so go on to the next shooter come out rolls an easy eight and we'll do the 64 across one more time put that ten dollars behind the pass line to pick up that eight cap the six and away we go okay hard six fourteen dollar winner and down with the four and the ten. Okay, there's the craps two. And as you remember, whenever we throw horn numbers, we always take down two numbers. In this case, it's the five and the nine. So that leaves the six and the eight. And there's the hard eight. That's the one we we're looking for. And so uh, the pass line bet six is, or the pass line bet is live. The place bet, the six is off come out rolls a hard 10 and so um, we're going to repopulate these numbers one unit and that'll be 32 across Let's see if we can keep this going okay there's the easy 10 that's a hit for us so we'll go ahead and take down the four also and we have another come out roll the um, pass line bet live place bets are off Easy eight, so we'll take the eight down and put five behind the pass line. And here we go. Easy four, nothing on the four, so we'll roll them again. <clears throat> and we seven out there. So that's not what we're looking for, and we'll go on to the next shooter. Obviously, uh, when we're throwing these, there's no way to have any dice influencing. It's all random. 
which is uh, what you're going to be up against most of the time at the craps table. So it's good to see that um, these strategies will work even in that situation, which is less than optimum. But let's keep this one going. Uh, five is our number. Here's the first row. Hard six, $14 winner. Four and the 10 come down. Next roll is a craps two. So that's a horn number. So we're going to take down the nine and the five to get that out of harm's way and roll them again. Another horn number. This time, however, we're down to two numbers. So we're just going to leave those up and keep rolling the dice. And there's the easy eight. So that's a winner. And we'll take down these last two numbers. Repopulated a lower amount. And we're going to put six behind on that five, so we get a full payout at three to two. And cap off the six and the eight. And we are ready to go. Easy ten, that's a nine dollar winner. And we'll take down the four and the ten. There's the nine, another winner. So we'll take that down and the sister number of the five. And there's the hard six. So we'll repopulate one unit one more time. Rinse and repeat. There's a winner five, $12 winner. So we'll go ahead and take down the four and the 10. This is the come out roll, so the place bets are off. There's a winner seven. Pay the pass line. There's the hard six. So we'll bring the six down with a $5 pass line bet behind so we get those odds and we'll uh, bring the five back up so here we go yeah, there's uh, craps two horn number so we take down the five and nine and there's the five oh well easy eight that's a winner so we made another round so let's repopulate the board And roll them again. And there's a nine, another seven dollar winner. Take, take down the four and ten. Easy eight, another seven dollars. Five and nine come down. Craps two, as we said before, since we only have two numbers up, we'll leave them both up. And we seven out there, but that was a good round. And we'll go on to the next shooter now. Easy six on the come out and 64 across. Cap that eight. Of course, we're betting on the six behind the pass line. Nine on the first roll, so that's a $14 winner. Four on the 10 come down. There's the hard four. The four's down, so no win there. Next roll is an easy eight, another $14. Five and the nine come down, and we're down to our last two numbers now. There's the five, there's a nine, easy 10, another five, there's a nine. We've had five straight throws where we did not hit either the six or the eight. That's a long time. So usually at four, I go ahead and take one of the numbers down. In this case, since the six is one of those numbers uh, on the pass line, I'm going to take down the eight and leave that six out there. And just in time, there's the seven. So ended up by still having a winning round there with that shooter. So next shooter up, there's a Yo 11, $5 winner. And this time it's the hard 10. So we'll go 64 across one more time. Put the, take the odds on the 10. Cap that six and eight, nice in hand. Yo 11, horn number, so you know that means the four and the 10 will come down. And there's the seven, that's why. All right, try it one more time here. Hard four on the come out. And since we had a losing round, we're gonna up the bets uh, to 25 on 
all the numbers except the 6 and the 8, we're going to make those 30. So that's 1, 2, 3, 20 across. Excuse me, that's 160 across, 25 on each number. So 160 across, $5 on the pass line. First roll, easy six, so $35 winner. Four and the 10 come down. Next roll is the five, that's a good one. And we'll take the five and nine down. And there's the easy 10, hard six. So we also hit one there and we'll take those two down and we'll come back with uh, 64 across and we'll put the four behind the pass line cap off the six and the eight four is the number there's the easy eight the fourteen dollar winner so we'll take down the ten and the odds bets on the four come down Next roll is the five, so that's another $14 winner. Five and the nine come down. Another five, looking for a six or eight. And there's the seven. So I think at that this point we're going to go ahead and um, call, it a, call it a session. So we started out at 14.11, ended up at 16.02. So that is $191 win, if my math is correct. So another uh, winning session on episode 4, using a six of 64 across strategy where we take down the numbers as we hit, have those score hits and also throw horn numbers. So we'll be back at you soon with episode 5. We hope that you uh, enjoyed this session. We hope that it was of some benefit to you and that you will join us again. If you like what you've seen, please hit that thumbs up button. Makes us feel good. And also, if you would hit that sub subscribe button. We're trying to get up to a thousand subscribers so we can start doing these sessions live with you. But uh, YouTube will not allow that until you get to a thousand. So we're working our way up. Hope you'll join